Who's, Who's that, that Pokemon? Pokemon? Hey guys, what's going on? It's Megafall here from Lads HD, bringing you a Pokemon Silver episode, episode number eight. We're bashing these out, Jimmy. What's going on? Nothing much, George. And if you guys want to guess the uh, who that Pokemon was, just write it down in the comments, and you'll find out at the end of the episode. Oh, and don't cheat and skip the exciting. episode. <laughs> Um, <laughs> <laughs> so yeah, uh, so we're up against the Wudo. We used the Squirt Ball, and for some unknown reason, apparently a Squirt Ball uh, awakens the Wudo, uh, moves it out of the way, and I don't really know why you can't just barge it, barge through. But you know, it's Pokemon. Yeah, and you can't you can't get past it until you beat the third gym and get the Squirt Bottle, which doesn't make sense because you could just use Water Gun, which has the same effect as a Squirt Bottle, but it doesn't make sense. But that's okay. <laughs> it doesn't make sense. But <laughs> um, did you catch the Wudo or? I'm fighting him right now, and you're going to find out in a minute, aren't you? Oh, I'm too impatient, Jimmy. I'm too impatient. Be patient. Be patient, George. And you need to be patient to be a Pokemon master. <laughs> if if you were 10, would you would you go down that route straight nine times out of 10, Jimmy? I would. Pokemon. If I was 10, if Pokemon was real, and you could go and <laughs> not go to school and just go do whatever... And I just knocked out Sudowoodo, by the way. Um, if you could go be a Pokemon master, I would do it. Well, I would try to do it. My parents would be like, no, you're going to school. And I wouldn't be able to be a Pokemon master, but I would want to. Yeah, but so they go, they go to school to learn about Pokemon, don't they? I, I don't know what they do. Because there's like, some sometimes they're just like, there's just like, like, like right now we're fighting like these two girls that are just standing by trees. And they're just like regular girls. But then other times you fight this the kids are like school kids it's like school guy johnny and stuff and i'm like i don't know if some of them are going to school and some of them aren't it just doesn't make sense it just doesn't make sense but that's okay i was just ash never, ash never goes to school so i don't understand i don't oh. understand if they all go to, go, go to school or not it's i was just cool. up against uh Suda Wudo. i'm going up to girls now but Suda Wudo, I, was, I wanted to catch him just because he's really rare and you can only catch him not once but um i used togepi tried to weaken him down with my weakest pokemon Ended up just wiping out Togepi with a um, <laughs> low kick, and I just like, oh fuck this, just bring out um, muscles, just raped him with like one kick or whatever. <laughs> I was gonna try to, I was gonna try to catch him, but then I don't even remember what I was thinking. I think I was just like, never mind. I just was like, at the time, I was like, I don't want to bother. Yeah, but right I, now, I hardly I ever, I hardly ever level him up as well. Right now, I wish that I did have him because I don't have any rock type. And he would prove to be pretty useful. Uh, Jigglypuff, most pointless Pokemon. The first time I, I remember the first time I played Silver when I was like eight years old. I thought because he's a he's a tree, so I was like, oh, I was like really excited. I was like, I'm gonna catch him. I'm like, oh, he must be a Leaf type because he's obviously a tree. So I was like, I'll just use my Totodile and use Water Gun to just weaken it a little so I can catch it, and it knocked it out because it's a Rock type. And I was like, my mind was just blown at the time, and I was just. <laughs> <laughs> You're playing that like mind fuck from the events. Yeah, I was just really, I was really confused, and I was like, I, I was like young, and I felt like crying because I really wanted to catch it, and I was just really sad. I was at my friend's house, and he was like laughing, and I didn't find it funny at all. Oh, poor younger Jimmy. Yeah, and but now in my older years, in my I have some wisdom now, and I if I wanted to catch him, I could have caught him, but I didn't. So you just got to take my word for it that I know how to catch a pseudo-wudo. Yeah. Um, we, oh yeah, daycare, guys. Uh, after we beat the uh, dream, gym leader in the episode before, I actually caught a ditto in the grass and um, put it in the daycare. So I'm probably just going to keep it there for as long as possible, just leveling it up. <laughs> and then we're once... just going to come back. We're going to come back on like the last episode of the series, like episode 100 or something. I don't know how many episodes we're going to have. Probably not, you know, not probably not nearly that much, but he's just going to be like, have like big muscles and stuff. Cause he's gonna be like level 100 by then. He's so just going to be just like be... ditto on steroids. <laughs> I don't, I don't understand how, another thing about Pokemon, I don't understand how I hate leaving a Pokemon in daycare makes it stronger because it's not fighting any pokemon it's just like sitting in the yard just dancing it doesn't make sense <laughs> it but... doesn't make sense at all <laughs> but, but again pokemon it's a good it's a great game doesn't make sense but that's okay because it's just really fun to play a lot of, yeah, a lot of... yeah you're not I, i'm sorry guys you're not you're not supposed to question pokemon and i'm doing that a lot today and i shouldn't be questioning pokemon because it's really epic we question and... it when it's like a game released for like dumb eight-year-olds <laughs> yeah, when I was when I was eight, everything made sense. I just like assumed I was like, yeah, that must be how the world works. Like when I was in pre-K, 
in daycare and when I was little, I, I was like, must have been that just must have been me leveling up. But now now I'm older and I realize that's not how it works. And here comes here comes Bill. Bill just came out of the stairs and went to Pokemon Center, but he really scared me. He like almost made me have a heart attack because I thought it was my rival because he has red hair, but it's not my rival. So it was tool bag. Yeah, I thought it was tool bag. It he, he scared the my like heart jumped and I was like, oh no, I'm gonna have to battle him. And my Pokemon are weak, but then he, he wasn't. He's like telling me about. I talked to him yeah, twice. What's, I think. what's up? What's he talking about? Time capsules and shit. I don't what. Because uh, I can't remember. Uh, upstairs in the Pokemon centers is like where you go. Like if you want to put like the game link cable, if you like want to hook up your Game Boy to another person's Game Boy, and they made the time capsules so you could trade between Pokemon Silver and uh, the old games like Pokemon Yellow and Red. So that's their their like. They, oh, right. I guess they made a t- time machine was how they was a way of explaining how it works, but also <laughs> also doesn't make sense. But that's yeah, what... it doesn't make sense. Don't question <laughs> it, Jimmy. Don't question it. Don't question, <laughs> don't question it. Don't question the game. Um, what is is this episode? Uh, I don't this want to spoil epi- it for the viewers. This is episode eight. Give me a short rundown without ex- telling the, the audience much about what happens. Do we just battle trainers in this episode? Um, I cannot remember. I th- I'm in the grass right now near those trainers, and because I just like bypassed the gym because we're not gonna fight the gym later this episode. But I went into the grass because I wanted to catch a certain Pokemon, and I won't tell you which Pokemon it is. If you're like a diehard Pokemon fan, you probably know which one it is if you know which Pokemon are on this route. But now I'm battling the trainer. I'm battling like a sailor, and I don't know why. Diehard this- Pokemon trainer. <laughs> <laughs> he's like yeah. oh, number one fan that guy who's like uh, who got like top rated comment on one of the videos he's like um, Flappy is purely electric when he evolves into Ampharos it stays pure electric and like Pokemon fanboys all thumbed it up <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I, I was one of the people who thumbed it up to be honest but he uh, yeah like he'll, he'll probably know which Pokemon I'm looking for out here and there's just a random a random sailor out here just in the middle of like the woods. So I'm battling that Dodo. Is... How sick! Oh, I love Dodo. He looks so sick. And when he evolves into, I thought Dodo... you said dildo. I was really confused for Dildo. a second. <laughs> Jimmy, don't say those bad words. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. We were talking about Kurt's balls, and there's like six-year-olds watching. No, that was episode five. Episode that five. Not... <laughs> episode five. <laughs> I was just, just thinking because we're doing this. Oh. Inv- we just advanced, uploaded episode five by the when the time we're doing this commentary. Yeah. But... Yeah, yeah it's like that commentary. There's like six-year-olds playing their little playthrough, and you're just like talking about balls and like sexual innuendos. <laughs> Can you imagine if like a six-year-old is like playing this for the first time? How awesome it must be for them. But then, but then again, they might think like, "Wow, this game sucks." Look at the graphics. They might be thinking that too. But yeah. and they might be wondering where like all the other 400 Pokemon are, because. Yeah. <laughs> they'd be like oh this is amazing why is there only 151 this must be like a rare Pokemon and they're like seeing they're like seeing these other Pokemon they're like seeing Rattatats and they're like oh my gosh I've never seen this before these must be super rare yeah <laughs> <laughs> like they go out at night time they see a Hoot Hoot and they're like what the fuck is that <laughs> and I'm just looking for this Pokemon right now guys and I can't it's not appearing and what is what is happening on your screen right now I'm just riding Actually, out on my bike, jumping over shit, went the wrong way, running back. I'm <laughs> trainers and stuff. I keep, oh my God, I failed about eight times. Pretty much I used my bike and I kept on pressing the down button a little bit too much. So I wanted to get to the berry tree and I just kept on jumping over the fence and having to go back around the side again. I did it to, twi- twice in a row. <laughs> and not to cut you off, I just ran into the Pokemon I wanted to catch. It is a Magnemite and as most of you know, he is an electric type, and in this game was the first time they introduced him as a steel type, and he fled, and I raged a little bit, and I failed to catch Jimmy, him on Jimmy. this episode. We're, we're coming catch up one. to the end. We're, we're at the end now. But um, pretty much, guys, I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, next episode will be coming next Thursday, as always. Give it a like if you enjoyed. I'll be Megafilar. See you later. See you guys. It's Fear